Halo the Master Chief Collection just got a new update out today, July 2023, and you can see these are some of the basic features. Now today we're going to be talking about the unreleased legacy content and how to actually download it. Now everything I'm going to show you, I'm going to have links to it so you can easily access it, but it's very simple, similar to other mods here. So you're going to want to start on the Steam page, go to MCC, you're then going to want to go to Workshop here. Depending on when you're watching this video, it might be in the popular items in the, in the week category. So for example, here's the Halo 3 maps. Now it's going to be the same for all these. You're going to want to go to the mod. Again, I'll have the link for you and then just click subscribe and it'll be added to your Master Chief collection. So you want to do that with Halo 3. If you're trying to access the Halo 2 content, you have to download the Dictacular map pack. Again, the link will be in the description. And then if you want to download the Halo 1 maps, you got to download the Excavated map pack. After all those are downloaded, you want to go ahead and boot up MCC. You're going to hit MCC and Sheet Disabled, Mods and Limited Services, and wait for that to boot up. All right, to actually access the content, all you got to do is go to multiplayer, and this all depends on what you're trying to choose. If you want to play the Halo 2 map pack, just go to Custom Multiplayer, boot up Halo 2 Classic, Modded Maps, and boom bada bing, here's all the maps, all 16. Uh, this map pack also has a single player like campaign level, so same process except the campaign you just go over to Hills anniversary and then you'll see Dictacular and then it's only one mission you can boot that up and there you go same process with the Halo 3 maps you just go to modded maps and you can see all the maps here except for uh, this one right here this is something else but yeah everything will be right here from that map pack and then it'll be the same thing with Halo 1 you to go to custom multiplayer and boot that up now from the maps I've tested, I've tested a few and they all work with multiplayer if they're using the modded version of MCC obviously and they also have the map pack installed but uh, I've tested a few maps now and they should all work in case you really wanted to play this really dark and you know rough draft number one version of midship. Hopefully this video helped you out. It's a lot easier to download mods these days compared to how it used to be. Thankfully 343 has been updating the mod tools but if this video helped you out be sure to like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to be making a kind of a long video going through all the different maps, just walking through, talking about them. So if that's something you want to see, be sure to uh, stick around. But until next time.